An alleged victim of sex assault suing the nation's oldest private military school. This is, we believe, a very serious uh, type of assault that took place. The allegation serious. A student raped in her dorm room at Norwich University by another student. Police and the state's attorney confirm there's an ongoing investigation into the suspect, but no charges have been filed. That's why we're not identifying him. Had the school acted properly and put student safety first, this wouldn't have happened. The victim is now suing Norwich, saying the private military school ignored three other women who complained about the male student before she was assaulted in November. But I believe that when, a, when a, anyone is sexually assaulted, that the damages are well into the millions of dollars. Her Florida attorney talked with Channel 3 News via Skype. We allege that Norwich University is negligent for what they didn't do. You know, when a university gets noticed that they have a male student who is sexually harassing uh, girls on campus, they need to take action to protect female students. Uh, they didn't do that here. And by failing to act, uh, they left this guy on campus and ultimately he sexually assaulted uh, my client. The university was unaware of the suit until I called the school. Norwich President Richard Schneider is out of state, but a spokesperson told Channel 3 News it's policy not to comment on pending litigation. The school later released a statement saying, Norwich University takes very seriously any report of misconduct within our community, and we investigate each and every allegation to the fullest extent possible and subsequently take action when and where appropriate. At Norwich University, we prioritize student safety above all else. Students we spoke with said they generally feel safe on campus. Well, we have a briefing at the beginning of the school year about sexual assault, but I'm sure we can do it like more often, maybe like, you know, raise the awareness to like once a month or, you know, at least twice a semester or something so we can do it more so then it can be in people's head a little more often than it is. I definitely feel safe. Like they definitely bring it up a lot and they have a lot of like outside resources and stuff for us to talk to. Norwich did not confirm if any actions were taken against the accused or if he was kicked out of school. The alleged victim is living out of state.